This video shows how to debug in Visual Code, uh, in this case, an, um, a web API C Sharp written in C Sharp. So what you see here is uh, this project. And inside there we have on the left side the tree and from the tree we have the platforms controller and uh, by the hell I want to see uh, when what happens if somebody uh, posts something on there so how to debug that so and in visual studio is you simply push f5 in visual code you have to do uh, the following you go here to your uh, debug you may start debug with f5 and uh, normally you start here you uh, with uh, .NET. most most developers start with dotnet run and dot .NET, uh, build run you see it in the bottom here but that, that's not the solution if you're a debugger if you're working on the code so <laughs> go on uh, we start with f5 or here with this uh, run start debug and after this when you start this one you will see here a lot of uh, script lines running the uh, this um, area in the bottom uh, switch to the debug console that's the difference and uh, you will also see here now this uh, local host here that's a new one and since you're running this one you see that it's running on that point so what we do now is this is a web api i want to post something against my uh, i want to post or i want to uh, the simplest way is uh, as always to throw a api uh, a get method so the get is somewhere here and since this one is the controller uh, let's see control b so this is we have more space uh, we always you may set a tr uh, a breakpoint in here or uh, where where the with the same name where the the static uh, where the initialization is so when you throw now um, a post on there a, a get method on there come on so when uh, this is my get method get something when i post this one and send it and you see that the breakpoint jumps on there uh, and since this one goes on I may switch with a step by with the F10 you go through each step you see the mapper and all that stuff and then you see the method at uh, the breakpoint jumping to the uh, endpoint or method which is uh, called in this case HTTP get give me all platforms and then you see all those val values uh, and you also see the value inside that stuff so you may normally you take this one let's see if it's possible I'm not sure uh, take this one to add it to the watch I can't see it at the moment here add to watch now you see that's the platform um, it's like in uh, in the browser written in the browser so it's a little bit different um, and now you see all values which are in there uh, and that's the point so have a have a look on that uh, that you start with f5 run start debugging and that you <coughs> have a look here on the debug console